for trading it all. So welcome back, everyone. My next guest has been on my show before a few times now. I have with me Kent Dixon. He's the owner of Life 365. Welcome p- back to the show. Tell everybody a little bit about yourself, what you do, and what we're going to talk about today. So uh, myself, I'm a native of Arizona, right? So one of the rare. Uh, Life 365 is my third company, uh, dealing mostly in connecting people at home in a cost-effective way to their doctors, sending data to the back end system the doctor can monitor them and keep them out of the hospital. Now what is this that we're going to talk about today? What is Aging 2.0? So Aging 2.0 is a, an organization that started about four years ago in San Francisco uh, where the mission is to accelerate uh, innovation uh, that improves lives of older adults. Uh, so we've started a chapter here in uh, Phoenix called the Aging 2.0 Phoenix chapter. Um, uh, we are a volunteer chapter that, uh, that hosts events uh, to try to uh, deal with programming, groups of entrepreneurs, technologists, designers, investors, senior care providers, trying to create technology and solutions for an aging population. Uh, we're all getting older, right? Tell uh, us about I, it. I Tell the, me about it. I think the statistic is in the next 25 years, um, half the population or the number of population will double of people that are 65, over 65. So, okay, is there a website, a special website for this that they can go to check out what you're talking about? It's going to be aging 2.0. No, I'm sorry, I can't read you right. Okay, I got it now. It's aging uh, two. Two dot com forward slash phoenix. I got it now. It's aging two dot com forward slash phoenix that you want to go up and check out some of this stuff. Now, what so uh, what is your local startup search all about? So we've got a we've got a, a local event that's going to occur next Friday on the twenty first at ASU Sky Song, uh, and what we're looking for uh, is audience members to participate in this. We've already selected uh, six companies, local companies that are dealing with solutions. Uh, that are for people that are 50 and above, right? Um, to be able to live independently. I mean, I don't consider myself a senior. A lot of people, even are 80, 85 no, years old, I am. don't consider I am themselves. A senior. Se- well, it's, it's all I a matter. I get the discount. There you go. <laughs> there you go. I got the AARP card when I, I was got 50, it. right? <laughs> um, but we want people to come and, and cheer and root on people for this event at ASU. It's going to be a, a full day of event. And we've got uh, six companies that are going to present there that uh, I think will be fascinating to people. There's a company called AMIA for Friends, uh, Friends for Elders, uh, that connects smart, um, empathetic friends together. It's almost like a tender, right, nice. uh, for seniors to find friends to be able to share events with or f- share common... Now, this is with. happening when? Uh, the 21st. So, okay, and, and it's all day? It's No, it's from 3.30 to uh, about 7.30. It okay. starts at 3.30. And the information is on the website? It is. Okay, so it's aging2, so that's the number 2, dot com forward slash phoenix you can go up there and check out all the information about it there as well and again that's uh friday the 21st right okay so all right let's talk a little bit more about it um tell us a little bit more about the companies that's a really neat one i really like that so there's the Cadius intelligence corporation which is has a, a, a product called silverlink uh it's for connecting home health care monitoring platforms for older adults together so Let's talk in layman's term. It's, it's so if help you, me out here. If you if you have home health care workers that need help, if you want to stay in your home longer, uh, it starts connecting people together to get the services to you. So if you need help by falling and can't get up, solutions right like PERS devices they call them. Right. So uh, for help, it starts. This company starts linking that all together. So in a sense, they have people out there, and I'm just getting this in my in my head for me together right now. If somebody on this particular one, if somebody instead of calling someone that tells them that they have this amount of these things that they would recommend for them. This is an actual site that they can go to? They can. Okay, go ahead. Right. And the, another one is called Elder Sense. And Elder Sense is a company that helps, and these are all local companies, right? Um, helps discharge uh, uh, people from the hospital with social workers and consumers to help find assisted living in communities um, you know, in communities that they can live in. So basically if you're discharged from the hospital and you need a place to live, right? 
this is a place to go to to be able to find the communities to do that and the resources to do that. Okay, now again, this is going to happen this Friday, not this Friday, it's going to be Friday the 21st. Yeah. The website is aging2, the number 2, so it's aging2.com forward slash Phoenix. And I'm sitting here thinking, gosh, I have a mother-in-law that's um, obviously, she's older and she um, it's an ex-mother-in-law, but uh, she lives in Sun Lakes and what a great opportunity for her. She's been fighting to do, you know, like to get on that uh, I fall and I can't get up kind of thing to have that. Right. What a great place for her to go there and f- find out more information about all of this and then decide, is this real for me or not? Right. For so, these things like this. Yeah, absolutely. There's, there's a lot of things you can see that are available, right, to, available to you and stuff. So another company we have, which is called Envoy America, it's, it's pretty exciting to me from the standpoint because it's a transportation is one of the biggest issues for seniors and those that have uh, chronic conditions, right, as well. This is as dedicated, like the Uber, right, of transportation. So you can actually uh, reach out to them to get transportation to your doctor uh, or to uh, to wherever you need to go, right, that's out there. It could be to the grocery store, and you can schedule it. So there's other companies in town that Uber that does, but, but Envoy is specifically about people with medical needs. Now, is there going to be anybody else there you want to get out about? Yeah, so another one is called Smart Brain Aging, right? So I don't know if you've uh, – I think you're familiar with, I know, with, with I Dr. Dembro. Uh-huh. Yes, I right? am. So Smart Brain Aging is going to be pitching there as well. Their technology – is for um, delivering research and supported programs and in person and virtually reduce cognitive de- decline in aging brains, right? So I've actually, they have something called, I think, Brain U, and I've actually taken uh, some of the courses with that as well. So it helps with uh, keeping you active and cognitive. It's awesome. Else. They were on my show, and so I know exactly what you're talking about. But this is an awesome place for you to go to find out what are the, what's out there for you at your hands so that you can you know, make your life a better life. Right. Absolutely. And then there's the last one that's called Zen Joy, uh, which is uh, creating, just almost like it's talk, creating peace of mind and happiness through dementia-based assisting technologies. So we have a couple that are related to the brain. Uh, We have a couple that are related to, or one that's related to transportation, Uh, a couple that are related to housing or home health care with that, and then others connecting friends together to be able to support each other. Again, now this is going to be Friday the 21st. Where is it going to be again? Tell them where it's going to be. So ASU Sky Song. If you don't know where Sky Song is, it's the corner of Scottsdale Road and McDowell, McDowell right? Mm-hmm. Uh, it's from 3.30 uh, to 7.30. There will be a reception afterwards. Uh, you can go on the aging uh, 2.0 or 2.com website slash Phoenix, right, to be able to get details of it. Or on Twitter at aging 20 PHX. Well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get all that information out for you right now. It is Friday the 21st. It starts at 3.30, and afterwards there's going to be a reception. Everyone likes that. Yeah. And again, this is great information for you. You can check it out. It's aging2. That's the aging, the number 2.com forward slash Phoenix. It's at ASU Sky Song, and it's from 3.30 to 7.30 with a reception afterwards. So, um, is it for people to go, do they, um, when they go up online and they see this. Do they register to go? Is it a free event? What is it all about? Yeah, so it's a free event. So there's an event right that's there for you to register right, to be able to go and uh, participate with it. I think at the event we're going to have a couple hundred people already uh, that are going to be, so it's a pretty good turnout right, to be able to do it. Great, great, great companies and we love the fact that ASU supports us in, in these events as well uh, to allow us to be at Sky Song. I mean, there's one thing I really love about ASU from this perspective is I don't know if many people know this I deal with the senior and aging uh, crowd that I'm doing, but um, I'm alumni of ASU, and ASU is now building a independent living and assisted living on campus. It's 20 stories. Uh, it's going to break ground here in the next couple months. It's called Marabella. Uh, it's going to be on uh, University and off of Mill, uh, where the Newman Center is, uh, and uh, it's going to be pretty fantastic. And that will be for who? So it's actually for us that are alumni, right? Anybody can live there, but it's meant 
event for alumni is to be able to retire. Uh, at, at, wow, uh, that's really neat. Right. So I as, imagine. So you know when, where you're going. Right. Maybe. <laughs> who knows? But maybe when I get into my 80s or something, maybe I want to start taking classes on campus, right, to do, and I can live on campus as well. And I'm sure there's a lot of people out there that at 80 now, that that's what they think about. It's not like it used to be. Right. Well, you're seeing a lot more people actually going back and getting their master's and PhDs in their 80s. I, and the other thing I want to talk about this event one more time really quickly before we go. This person that's going, it could be that it's the, the that you've got your um, parents that are older that you don't know. That's a, Tell them the, the person that's going to the event. So Do I, they bring their parents with them? Go ahead. They, we, we encourage that because, you know, we don't want the, these are entrepreneurs that are pitching and building companies. We don't want, uh, uh, you know, people building companies that aren't going to be used. The product's not going to be used. Right. So, you know, I, with my own parents, I would encourage them to go. They happen to live in Iowa. But I always say with my mom, there's perception, then there's reality. Perception is she's going to use a, a gadget, right? Reality is she's probably not, right? Right. She's going to do it her own way. So why don't we build companies and technology that's going to be used by seniors the way they want to use it instead, right? Don't build applications that are just going to be on smartphone if if people aren't using smartphones, right? They're using flip phones instead. So it's important to have people show up that are seniors to give their insight and input to these companies to make sure that we're building the right things to live, you know, independently. And if you're listening to this and you think this might be something for your senior, please go. This is going to be on Friday the 21st. It's at 3.30 to 7.30. There's a, um, there is a reception afterwards. It is at ASU Sky Song. And again, you could check out all the information. It's a free event. It's Aging2, the number two. So Aging2.com forward slash Phoenix. What are your final words real quick? Just show up and give us your uh, support. Check it out. It's Aging2.com forward slash Phoenix.